How are we doing, everybody? It's Craig, and I'm back, and I got a good old-fashioned unboxing for you. I'm also back as far as I think I got the flu almost totally beat. A couple of days, I should be good to go. Thankfully, it's the weekend, so I got the close couple of days. But the unboxing, I mean, as if I'm trying to make you a surprise, you already saw a thumbnail. We have BAM Horror. And I'll be 100% honest with you, I say this all the time. About half the time when I get BAM Box, I get it by accident. Because I forget to cancel. Um, I don't have a problem with BAM. I've, I've gotten over that aspect of it. I think it's BAM's okay if you specifically go in after certain things. And thankfully, some of the admins have been pretty cool. Like, when we knew we were having Dream Warriors items, I wanted on those boxes. Nancy was going to sign one in on those boxes. Excellent. I got that, and that's what happened. Nancy was December's box. This order renewed, and I forgot about it. Um, but it's okay. It doesn't the themes that I remember. I actually only remember three, so I don't know if there's only three, or if there was a secret one, or if there's a fourth. But the themes were Halloween Rob Zombie. So not... Definitely not that new one, which I, well, you can look at my videos and find out what I think about that one. Um, Child's Play 2, which I'm trying to think why they would go to specifically, what are they separating, um, and, you know, but we'll see. And then The Shining. Um, I still say one of the best items I ever got in a mystery box came from The Shining. Okay, it was a hard box, hard, hard box back in the day, that damn key holder, which isn't heavy enough to have anything like that in but it has a little bit of weight, so I'm hoping I got a weapon. Because they, they did say something like that. Some people get a, we a weapon. And if it's a weapon, it's Halloween. Um, I'm assuming it's a knife signed by Tyra Maine, which, you know, I know they did that before in, a, um, in, in like one of their special boxes, but never did in this. That'd, that'd be neat if that's the case. Uh, but that said, I'm rambling a lot. Side effect of sick medication, maybe, or just I haven't been on in a while. And for those of you that have been hitting me up about the movie, the movies uh, reviews I've been doing, I know I'm only at 19. We'll get a few more done. Listen, the goal for the year is just to be more than we had last year. So last year, I think I watched 175. If I can hit two this year, I'll be fine. And if that's the case, the pace is holding up okay. Um, but let's open it. I do like the fact that I guess now these officially, they're going to stay with these boxes. Um, you know, because now they have the symbol on instead of a sticker, which is good because it somehow saves them money. The black box wasn't, you know, or maybe they're going to separate the black box as far as regular. I don't know. The real question is, do they have the black tissue paper? Okay, so I don't really have a table where I am, but I gotta... No, I didn't open something. See what happens when you're not... No, that's open. Hmm. Oh, is something taped when it's not taped? Interesting. Well, this is just wedged in there really well. So we got to untape and rip. Okay. So once I get open, I'm going to put off the side. I'm going to move over the laundry basket, which you can't really see. Um, but And I'm going to pick out of it without looking, because that's the fun of the mystery box. Oh, I see what's happening. I was opening up the long way. Because it's... Uh -huh. I'm a mess. Again, that's the fun of the mystery box. Okay. It is open, and I cannot see, I assure you. Let's see. <laughs> we got anything falling out. Stop. Okay. Tissue paper. Okay, something heavy. Something actually pretty heavy. Metal medallion. Oh! This is very, very sweet. If I'm not an idiot, if it's what I think this is. Um, I, I, and that would explain the child's way to, to, to think that. Um, and I used to do that, and so can I read this? Like, with a person, so, I don't know if this is all accurate. Actually, I'm not sure if it's all accurate. But either way, this is the medallion from Child's Play 2 that he needed to have to transfer the souls. And if it's not, I'm making up. I'm having a weird vision of a movie, something in a movie that didn't exist. I apologize. But I like that. That's that's a hell of a pop. I'm assuming Dark Matter doesn't say it on here, but I know, you know, they do the collabs with them all the time, which makes sense. If it isn't broke, don't fix it, right? 
I like that. That explains the weight, though. So it means I don't think I got a knife. We do have a dreaded poster. Um, although the poster, okay. It's a poster, but it's an art cell. So that's neat. I just say that because I have so much wall space to... I mean, you can kind of see. I can move some stuff, but... When I move that stuff, I have so many things waiting to go in those places. I would say when I'm looking at it, it looks like a bird. At first, I'm going to say it's like Scuttles. Who are you? It's not Scuttles, by the way. That's a reference to a Disney cartoon. Uh, the certificate is to authenticate the original hand-painted production animation show from the animated feature film Monster Mash. If your artwork is one of a kind, authentic, original piece of art. I like getting stuff like this, I do. I'm not too familiar with Monster Mash. But I like doing a goofy vulture condor type thing. That is neat to me. Art cells are nice. If this was, if this is a cartoon I was more familiar with, it'd be phenomenal. But I like that a lot. Very, very neat. And just think, look at the work that used to go into cartoons. Not that they still don't have to do a ton of stuff, but the computer has made it much more pliable. So I guess that was sort of a mystery, a mystery item of sorts. That's neat. Okay, we got a pin. The pin is, hmm, now I'm having second thoughts. Was I mistaken? Is that not the amulet from Chucky? Was there never an amulet from Chucky and I? Am I making that up? So we have a, ch a Chucky pin. Well, maybe it's more appropriate to call it a good guy doll pin, because that's not the Chucky that's going to come and kill you. That's the little buddy that you had to sleep with your kid at night. Next up. Okay. Paper, 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 paper. Yes, they still have the black paper. And nothing there. Okay. And next. Huh. Okay. I'm going to pick it up and... Feels what I feels. Okay, looks like a car. One, two. So what, maybe is a comic, maybe an auto. And then some sports spoiler, so... We'll look at the spoil last, obviously. I'm hoping this is... Okay, this is the print. Um, and it's signed by the artist. I don't know if this is the auto. Fan art collection, Red Rum. Uh, signed by Davis Ryder from the Bam Box. That's neat. That's a cool print, print of, the, um, of the twins and Danny. It's actually really funny. I gave... Some of you might know what I do for a living. I'm a college, I'm a college professor. And I, I gave my dean an office warming gift. I actually gave him a, an autographed photo of, like, the, um, the, the twins in The Shining, the butchered one. And he has it hanging up in his office. I think it's great. I'm like, just tell the students that's what happens when they're difficult. He doesn't say that, I hope. But. Okay, and now we're down to an autograph, which I'm assuming, since it's Halloween, it's got to be Tyra Maine. Oh, I assumed wrong. Oh, I wish I assumed. I wish I assumed right though. This is not Tyler Maine. This is Dag. Uh, Dag? This is the kid. That's who this is. I will say, I have one of this kid kid's autos already, which it's a trade, and now I have another one of his autos, which is also a trade. Um, this is a badass picture though. I do like that. I just, I don't know, I just never got into pick, picking up the kid photo autos. Like, I didn't really get into that in It. I didn't really get into that with Stranger Things. Um, even, even Ari Raymond, like, I got it because it's a Jason, but that's somewhat reluctant. Um, but that said, not a bad, bad, not bad. And now let's take a look at the spoilers. We have... Happy New Year, we're excited to start New Year. Okay, so they have all the animation cells. Again, some of them are badass. Um, some of them have, like, Frankenstein, Dracula. You know, their cartoony versions, which is phenomenal. So, let's see. Was I right about... I could not have been more... Am I... Was there not an amulet? I thought there was an amulet in Chucky. I could not be more wrong about what I said. Freaking A. I'm... Now i got to go back and think about things. Um, no, the amulet came... this comes from Sleepy Hollow. Uh, and this is Sleepy Hollow, the TV show. Yeah, and I used to watch it. I should have I, Okay, the two prints, the autos of Chucky, of him in various states of decay. I'll show them to you in a second, depends. And the knife could, could have been a knife with the little Mikey guy. 
Um, and you could have had the, uh, no, the other print, I think, is really, really cool. But here you go. This is what we're looking at. I think that other print is really sweet. You know, you could have that. You could also win uh, an autograph of the Shining Twins, which is nice. What am I thinking about with Child's Play? I know he had the knife. Didn't he have it? What he had? He have an amulet of some sort. I don't know. Admittedly, Child's Play is on my list of um, probably Reese viewed. You know, for me, it would be Jason, Freddy, Halloween, TCM, Child's Play of the Big Five. And if I throw Scream in there, it'd probably be Jason, Scream, and push him down even some more. We call it the Big Six. But folks, thank you for checking out my video. I know I haven't had a, a, a boxing up in a bit. Um, I do have another one coming soon. Fight Crate should be here in a couple of days, which is always phenomenal. Um, but if you like what you saw, I know it ran a little bit long. If you're with me this long, kudos. You know, by all means, give it a like. If you haven't sub, sub. I do have a really cool contest planned when I hit 400 subs. I'm not marketing or anything like that. I'm... I drop a little, little bit about every each, every couple of videos, but if I hit that point, it'll be awesome. And I have I want to help. I definitely want to try to help a collector sort of get a good start going on maybe a collection of something. But we'll see. You know, we'll see if it happens or not. But either way, as always, thanks for checking stuff out, and you have a good one. Peace. Adios. Avida Zane. Ciao.